Having your own authority doesn't make you a boss. Picking nah. your direction doesn't make you a nah. boss. Because DOT me. still run your company. Oh. <laughs> and, you know, a lot of, you know, I, I don't want to go into it, but go a lot of owner-operator authority guys, they will not want to go into that DOT way station, you know. But we ain't going to talk about that. Mm. So, so you, you ain't know, scared of the way station? No. Nah, oh, I get the green light. I'd never go in there. Oh, man. Do you imagine that? when you get to california on sunday to tuesday boom you know where you're going if you get to laredo you can either go to florida cali illinois new york something like that boom if you go to pennsylvania you can get a load to ogden so it's, it's all the same and as long as you keep moving that's all that matters and when you know your numbers that's the thing too when you know your numbers mm. You're not out here stressing. That's the difference. A lot of people don't know their numbers. When they, when I first came out here, they said, how are you driving for Stevens, man? They ain't making no money. But I knew exactly what I needed to make every week to be successful. And I was making double of what I needed to make, so I was good. So, you know, the, the going where you want to go, I mean, that's that's up to you. That's, you know, people that... So you're saying picking the direction where the truck is going doesn't make you a boss? No. Having your eyes in out and I have to, you know... Having your own authority doesn't make you a boss. Picking nah. your direction doesn't make you a nah. boss. Because DOT me. still run your company. Oh. <laughs> and, you know, a lot of, you know, I, I don't want to go into it, but go a lot of owner-operator authority guys, they will not want to go into that DOT way station, you know. But we ain't going to talk about that. Mm. So, so you, you ain't know. scared of the way station? No. Nah, oh, I get the green light. I'd never go in there. Oh, man. Do you imagine that? Mm. 2020, 2019. You know, it's not it ain't really, you know, so. Well, I mean, don't, Ghost got a 29, what is that? I don't know what Ghost has. What is I, don't, I don't know what he got either. I don't, I've never, I don't know what I, truck I don't really be paying attention. I but just, I don't, I, mean, I don't, I mean, I feel like you can make money with the truck if you guys. Right. Well, I mean, he did have a picture where I think he, he said something about a level one inspection or something, but that might have been mm. somewhere, but I don't know. That's, that's all I saw, but I don't really be paying attention like that. You know, I just be scanning through, but uh, you don't watch other YouTubers, right? Yeah, yeah, you get you get it kind of busy, and you know, and it's funny because I remember one time you was like, "Yo, you know, don't call me. I'm I'm, I'm not available. This and that." And I was like, "Dang, man, why are you doing people like that?" But <laughs> <laughs> makes sense now. Doesn't it? <laughs> now it's like, yo, like some people, you know, if you're not, and it's not even like just like subscribers or people or friends, like family, bro, like. If we not talking in business or, you know, something you really got to talk to me about, like, I don't have the time right now no. to really talk to you. So, it's just like, you know, I, I Why see... Why are we talking? Right, right. It's, hey, man, what, what you doing today? What? <laughs> I'm yeah, working, bro. Like, I'm, I'm working. You I know mean, what I'm saying? You're here in the room with, with me. We're doing this interview. Um, <laughs> I can't wait to hear what people say about that, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, right, right. You're right. safe, right? right? <laughs> but I mean, we're here where we're doing this. Conference is about to happen. Right. Flights are about to come in. I had to get a load here, which is doing a big deal. The trucking business, trucking business. In the middle of all that, still, I'm I'm way too busy, right? To really, really beef with somebody, right. I can have a disagreement, right? But the beef word needs to be put to bed. Yes. Now, yes, yes. as far as y'all situation with this whole uh, fleet and which one should you do, I hate to take a side. But if I actually was going to take a side between, you know, the, the ghost and the low thing, mm -hmm. I would lean Lowe's way. Right. Now, the reason why I would, I'm not going to say it makes more money. I'm not going to say that. Way. Right. I'm just going to say as far as just simple from headache, I would definitely lean that side. Dude. Yeah. I've had an older truck or a, a, a truck that was, I, I just, who wants to be in the shop? Dude? Who wants to be in the shop? Right. That's how I feel. But see, I really don't have a dog in the fight because I'm not a big time four million a year nah, type you, guy you like you. <laughs> you know what I'm all I'm doing is drive my truck, get my money, and live my best life. Right. That's all I could possibly do. But if I was the pick... God, that just seems like it's very a big, a big. It sounds like a big headache. Yeah, and and again, I'm not picking the side. Mm, a little bit. I, but I just only because that's where I am now. Because I'm I'm not really. I'm just saying, don't say that you can't make money in this space. That's what I'm saying. 
Because do I want to have my own authority one day? Of course. But don't say that I can't make money in the space that I'm in right now. Don't say that I'm beneath you because that's not the truth. But did he say that, though? No, but that's how they feel. That's how they feel. Trust me. They yeah. feel that way. Now, I'm not saying him. I'm just talking about in general. authority guys, owner operators, guys that's been driving for 20 goddamn going years. But, you know, mm. yeah, those those guys. So yeah. they think basically you got a, a fake fleet. Yeah, yeah. Because, like I said, it was one guy. He's, you don't got all those trucks. Like, why would I lie about that? Why, why do I have time to lie about that? Yeah. And that's just like, you know, me being successful at Stevens. Why would I lie? For three years? Like, who? why would I stay at Stevens for three years if I'm not successful? But they, they, you know, didn't call me coon dog and, you well, know. you do. And, you know, but see, you know, know the and, sugar step a little bit. And you because I'm, I'm, I'm in business, man. You know what I'm saying? And I'm in business too. I don't have to. I don't. I don't that. And see, you going, you going a different way. I'm trying. I'm, and it's not even people can look at it that way. Mm -hmm. But it's me learning information from successful situations. Okay, not one. Tr and it's again, people gonna get upset. But if you have, and I hate this, you know, because this is what Lo said. Yeah, I feel the same way. If you have one truck, please don't talk to me. I don't have time to hear what you're talking about. I've done that already. I'm past that. Mm -hmm. I'm where I am now. Don't take it the wrong way, Mr. Butthurt Guy, but that's just how I feel. You can't tell. What are you going to tell me? Because I'm doing it for eight different trucks. Oh, I got to deal with personalities as well. So mm -hmm. you can't tell me that. You're just dealing with yourself. When it was just me, easy. But when you have, like today, I got a driver that needed to be home. Mm. In South Carolina, mm. he's in Ohio. They give him a load to New Hampshire, and he like, bro, that's not gonna work. So I want to help my driver out. He's one of my best drivers too. So I gotta make sure I, hey, I call who I need to call. Again, I could be doing something else. If I was a one truck pony, mm. then I could be doing that's my own bad. thing. Yeah, I felt that one. That, 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 my man. <laughs> No, 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 I'm saying it's stung a little bit, dog. And before all of the other different right. people get on me, dog, I ain't liking that right is now. It? Let's be real. It's, it's YouTube, man. Get out, you know. But, <laughs> but you know, you can't, you can't tell me anything that I don't already know. You know, well, you don't know about IFTA. You don't know about compliance. You, that's a lie because... Well, well, I'm trying to find ways to combat what you're saying. I will say they can't say, well, you know, I mean, I'm only a one-truck pony. Right. But I have I own my truck and trailer outright and have my own authority. So technically, you're you know you're not even doing what I'm doing for one truck for all eight. Someone's doing it for you. So how can you be? But they're still to... driving them. Oh, okay. Ugh. I mean, but technically, if someone quits today, you're driving too. No, I'm not. I got a guy that's about to quit in um uh, uh April. But the truck just sits. No, no, no. Again, walk away lease. I get a get a truck back. They make sure everything's good. They cut me a check. We good. It's that simple. <laughs> Sorry. Mm. It's that simple, you know. So, again. So, it's safe to say since you've been within the, um, how do I put this word in a way that keeps you safe in your situation? Uh, <laughs> since you're within the regime, okay? Um, we really don't know any of your views until you get yourself out of it. No, no, I still, I still speak my... I don't think so. I don't think you can really... We can't really go on the talks I like to go on until you're in a position where you can say what you want to say without having that circumstance pushed upon you by the, the overlords. No, no, no. Not like I can say what I want to say as long as I'm not... Again, this is my business partner. So I'm not going to talk, you know, I tell the truth. About their but I'm not gonna, yeah, I'm not going to talk reckless no, I'm not them. interested in their business or yeah. flat rates. I wouldn't right. talk about that. I mean, I'm just being real. I just... I. I because I, I heard what you said with the, their training, so that's about 6,000 miles a, uh, a, tr a truck a week. Sometimes. And if you're getting a dollar a mile, that's 6,000 in revenue. And then, you know, extra pay. People don't know about extra pay. So but what I'm pay. saying is this. My brother Shooter mm -hmm. is, is, is training Lease, and he's doing, and he, he's doing like, he can do 12 grand with percentage so i really don't understand like could you, couldn't it wouldn't it be better if you had that same type of office situation but on a percentage scale yeah i, I want to get percentage but i can't do what i'm doing at stevens transport anywhere else definitely no, no. I, I have eight trucks and i've only put down three thousand dollars <laughs> yeah you're not gonna be able to 
if I if I go over to you know to the other regime, well, I gotta put down leave, I gotta put down fourteen thousand dollars per truck. I'm not doing that. Oh, uh, who told you? I uh, hold up, bro. <laughs> hey, bro, I do my research. Get out of our man. office, man. I, 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 I called other places, and you know, cause there's you know again, I got business parts. So when I get angry, I, oh, I can't. Never mind. Hey, Stevens, I'm back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> don't get inside yourself. Cause over here we don't like you like that. You're a regular drive. Over yeah, there, yeah. It's just it's uh. It's a good situation. Again, I'm learning the business. Um, I spent three weeks in, in Dallas, and uh, you know they let me sit in and uh, work with recruiting. I sat down with the dispatchers or, or the planners and and uh, driver managers and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. that was a good uh, experience. So, well, I mean, it's not listen. I mean, the 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 cinnamon stepping thing, <laughs> sugar cooning, jigaboo. Right, right, right. You know. Turkey stuff and whatever they want to call it, you know. I when I do it, I'm joking. Right. Me and you talk all yeah, yeah, of yeah. the air. Yeah. So I mean, you're you're close to, you're, you're not all the way, but you're dang near one of the, the most conscious people. Right. That I really really know. Some people believe think that being conscious is being militant, and right. that's not the same thing. No, no, no. You know, that's not the same thing. But um, a couple of your views I don't agree with, but. I may be a little bit more on the...